Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your uh, general daily message for Thursday, September 19th, 2019. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested, we are now starting off those private readings. I did get the green light from my doctor, uh, so everything is good to go. So if you are interested in a private reading, uh, the link will be down below in the description box. Uh, glad to be back, man. I missed you guys. Uh, so anyway, let's get started. Whomever this is meant for, I pulled a 10-card spread, 5 above, 5 below. I did clarify the one card here as well as an outcome card and two clarifiers. Uh, so let's get started. Whoever this is for, you first start off with the Three of Swords. So a lot of heartbreak is what I'm feeling here, okay? Uh, in regards to which direction do I go, I clarified that card with the Two of Wands here. Yeah, you kind of been at a crossroad here, kind of stepping back in regards to all the heartbreak that you've been going through as to say, which direction am I going here in regards to love I feel? Because it's been extremely confusing situation with the Seven of Cups, okay? And the option as well. As the option with that Two of Wands, you know, it's kind of like I had this heartbreak. I don't know which direction to go in. This has been so confusing. This has been a long time coming with this Knight of Wands. But look at the direction that you're heading towards with the Ace of Wands right after that. I literally take, I know I say it all the time, which direction, what they're pointing at. This dude is literally heading towards. So this has been a long time for, uh, could be dealing with, or you could be fire as well. But regardless, there's a new beginning after taking quite some time, I feel. But you're moving forward, okay? With the Six of Swords here as well. You're moving, thank you. You're moving away from the heartbreak as well, I feel. Sword energy is those thoughts. Uh, to a better, brighter future. Nice. With the sun here. Uh, literally turned face in that sun. The sun is the best card that you can get. It's very upbeat, positive. It's also known as the yes card as well. So I do feel that somebody has been in search of. Uh, with the King of Pentacles here, um, Pentacles does represent Earth, so you could be or you could be dealing with Earth. But like I said, got to see what he's looking up at. And what is he looking up at? The Ace of Wands. So his head is turned looking up at that. I take that seriously. So you're trying to remain balanced. That Pentacle is that balance here, looking up for a whole, I just heard, fresh new start here. In regards to getting that wish fulfillment with the Nine of Cups. Somebody wants a new start. Somebody wants a fresh uh, new start here and to get their wish fulfillment and they've been trying to stay strong leo energy as well but the energy of this chick here is turned it's like dude i'm trying to stay strong in regards to getting this wish fulfillment now the wild thing is is that you got the justice card libra energy does not have to be but what's wild and crazy is is that you got the sun card so yes okay now there's a few different messages here you are going to move forward in regards to the balance. The Justice card is all about that balance, okay? Uh, this is the Yes card. Yes, there will be balance again. But yes, I do feel that there will be communication as well. She's holding, you know, normally under another deck here, she's holding that that uh, scale, you know, and then the sword in the Rider Waite deck. That's what I'm feeling here in regards to communication and balance brought back in because here's the outcome. High Priestess, somebody has definitely been out in the dark about things of the unknown, not knowing, you know, and I feel that this is somebody from your past because I know it's opposite from my phone, but she's literally jumping towards her past. So I feel that in regards to somebody from your past that, that you've been kind of in the dark about things and of the unknown, somebody is now analyzing the situation. I'm feeling that it's not the person that was heartbroken. I feel that it's the other person who broke your heart, okay? And they're looking at that, you know, I am have to make a decision to have the death card, which is that change. So I feel that somebody is now realizing that, hey, I need to make a decision in regards to the unknown. What do I do? And they're going to decide to have some type of change in regards to clearing up that communicate or that confusion, I feel, making that final choice, being able after quite some time to start anew. You're moving towards a whole new beginning, a very promising future, I feel, of that communication, that balance brought back in because, and you know, it's not, it's not easy, you know, <clears throat> excuse me, but you stayed strong to get this wish fulfillment. Good for you. You tried to stay balanced after very confusing uh, situation as well as heartbreaking. So that's what I have for whomever this is meant for. Thanks, guys. Have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.